Reigning Chicago mob boss John No Nose DeFranzo was an original target of the family secrets investigation, according to these Justice Department records released tonight. Along with this man, Alphonse Pizza Al Tornabini, the outfit's elder statesman. The objective in this case is to indict and convict high ranking members of Chicago organized crime, including DeFranzo and Tornabini, stated the government in 2002. But despite this case summary naming them as targets, neither DeFranzo nor Tornabini were among the 14 outfit members charged in 2005 with murders and mayhem. As of 2007, Tornabini was still meeting with suspected outfit figures. You know about that? I don't remember. And as of last month, the I-Team found DeFranzo meeting with mob underlings at a suburban restaurant. Are you concerned that, uh, no, that no, you may I'm end up in uh, family no. secrets too? No. The U.S. Marshal Service files were made public tonight in the case of Deputy John Ambrose, now on trial for leaking information to the mob about Nick Calabrese, the highest-ranking Chicago mobster ever to become a government witness. According to the witness protection records, Calabrese said he and John DeFranzo planned and committed the most notorious mob hit of the last 25 years, the gangland murders of brothers Anthony and Michael Spilatro. Nick Calabrese's testimony was to be so spectacular that 24 men were listed by the feds as threats, all of whom would want to kill him. Nick Calabrese lived to testify and federal prosecutors won the family secrets case. But as these records show, there are still some secrets left. Chuck Gowdy, ABC 7 News. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC 7 Chicago YouTube channel.